Hello. Today we're going to speak again about cryptocurrencies and blockchain. In this case, we're going to speak about uh, mining, cryptocurrency mining. As we know, for blockchain to exist and uh, cryptocurrencies, there is the need of uh, companies that mining that mine the coins. These companies have been evolving considerably and due to the increase of value of uh, cryptocurrencies, now around $2.4 thousand billion, they have been growing in importance. Riot, Marla, Hive and some other uh, cryptocurrency mining companies are developing, investing and, and, and growing a lot. Uh, there are also a lot of uh, Bitcoin mining companies and cryptocurrency mining companies in China and other places. Uh, but we're here to speak about taxation, taxation in Portugal of these mining companies and the experience, although not on a professional level, of a colleague of mine, which does a lot of taxation issues on cryptocurrencies and has a small bit, Bitcoin mining uh, activity at home because he wants to increase his experience and level of knowledge by operating uh, in a small scale uh, mining. Uh, mining in Portugal uh, can be developed either via company and you're liable to corporate tax. You have your activity and the profits, and then you have the costs, and you're taxed basically on the profit at the 21% tax rate, uh, plus 1.5% of municipal surcharge. In total, 22.5%. If you develop the activity in your own, own name and you apply for non-habitual tax regime, you can mine and be taxed on a 20% flat rate. You know, you need to do, uh, for this purpose, you need to be qualified as a profession of accrued value, which is defined in Portuguese law. And basically are all the professionals, all the professions that are important, important for the development of Portugal. Uh, but if you work somewhere else and you do your activity uh, as Fabio is doing, you know, not in a professional manner, the, big, the, the mining results and the profits that you have are not going to be liable to tax. And I'll let him speak a while about this. First of all, thank you very much for the invitation. Yes, regarding mining and the same situation as buying and selling of cryptocurrencies or buying and selling of non-fungible tokens, here in Portugal we have a lack of regulation. First of all, it's always important to keep in mind if it is done through a professional uh, activity or a professional company, it will be subject to taxation, of course, um, and in the private level, it will be in principle exempt if it's not the main activity of such individual that performs this type of uh, activities. What is important to keep in mind is that exists this lack of uh, regulation and it exists two binding opinions of issued by the Portuguese tax authorities that uh, of course uh, give us this information regarding taxation, specifically in naming when it's done through uh, a structure or as an individual if it is the main uh, activity always is important to keep in mind that every uh, activity that is done and this includes mining if it's not the main activity it will be in principle exempt of taxation it's of course a zone and an area that is still under development portugal is a crypto friendly uh, country because the lack of legumentation it's not in the way that we have 
crypto friendly uh, laws or tax laws applying is because we don't have specific laws that apply uh, specific rules that apply to this type of activities so from this perspective if you decide to incorporate a company to perform this activity like mining keep in mind that it's mandatory to have a registration at the portuguese national bank bank of portugal and uh, to all the individuals all the companies that want to perform mining or buying and selling of cryptocurrencies or that directly or indirectly works with uh, crypto assets um, this is again uh, the conclusion is that portugal and using the non-habitual tax regime or developing your activity or non-professional way is very friendly for tax purposes and it's very attractive to develop the crypto mining activity in Portugal. Thank you.